I, ha I had a problem with the flat and the curve, but I went along with it also, I must say, to my own shame, because uh, they said, else the collateral damage that arises is too big because all the hospitals will be on so on. Everybody knows the story. And I went along with this, but then, just as you said, all over Europe, the curve came down. And independent, independent of whether there was a harsh lockdown or not. It was just whatever a country did, didn't matter. The curves were coming down. So that means that all the model calculators, the epidemiologists with their self-made computer programs, that was basically bullshit because there was a basic immunity there. The virus had not a chance to infect everybody. The virus very often stumbled at, over people who were immune. And that is, until today, the most panic-inducing principle, namely that most media still speak about, today we had so and so many new infections, which is totally, it's not true. A virus, it, it, it's a particle, it goes to everybody. So if somebody is immune, the virus also goes in, into this body and it will multiply even a little bit. But if you're immune, you attack the virus first with antibodies and you make immediately debris, the virus is destroyed, you have only parts of the virus around in, in your tissue, if you make a swap or in your blood, if you go and test your, you will find this, this debris and part of the debris will be nucleic acids, RNA. And if you make a PCR, all these people will be positive because the PCR picks up two tiny, or if it's a good assay, three, sometimes two, sometimes only one tiny little piece of RNA that is then amplified. And this assay cannot tell you whether you had the virus or you just had some dead chunk of the virus, which still gives you a positive result. So, so a corona positive with a PCR, everybody should realize this is not a quantitative assay. It's a qualitative assay. It tells you only a little tiny bit of DNA of RNA nucleic acid was there, but it doesn't tell you whether it was a, what the virus complete or even a virulent, uh, meaning a virus that can really make you sick. All this is not in this test. This test only says little piece was there, and that no other virus ever on this planet has been accompanied by so much testing and a testing that has created so much nonsense and panic.